Danubio Budapest building by T2 Dota Architects in Budapest, Hungary. Designed by T2 Architects and completed recently on the site of a former river gravel pit, on the banks of the Danube in Budapest, the Danubio residential building responds to the unique urban and natural environment, partially overriding the rules of Budapest real estate developers, and realizes a concept that treats sustainability not only as a slogan but also revives many pre-existing but now forgotten architectural solutions and recreates them in a modern, timeless form. Location The site is located north of downtown Budapest on the southern side of the Foka Bay, a former industrial area and harbor, which was created around the 1960s as a result of gravel mining and named after the former operator and abandoned in the 1990s. The aim of the invitation to tender launched by the developer in 2016 was to draw up a complex development plan for a residential building with around 360 apartments and its surroundings to be built on a unique industrial brown site to revitalize with a direct connection to the Danube and a panoramic view. To make the former industrial site suitable for housing and public areas, major infrastructure investments and a complex development strategy were needed. From the very beginning of the planning process, our concept included the natural rehabilitation of the Foka Bay and the provision of physical connectivity and public access to the public areas. Together with the development public areas have been created thus the bay and the creek areas are now connected, and all the flood protection, road, and utility systems have been completed. Concept The architectural concept was first approached from an urban point of view, mapping scale and mass and urban connections. The aim was to design not just a condominium with an attractive facade, but a building that could be viewed from multiple angles and distances, responding to both the natural and built urban environment with equal detail. As a solution, a building volume consisting of two connected superstructure parts was created, which on the one hand follows and exploits the strange geometric features of the site and on the other hand reacts dynamically to the adjacent mass of the National Swimming Center. The building's volume has a practical functional and energetical purpose in addition to its urban presence. The mass of the two parts of the building and their relationship to each other allows the maximization of the frontal surfaces towards the Danube and the bay. The dynamic, stepping outwards mass of the building also acts as a passive energy device. The accentuated white cornices on the edges of the floors, offset by 53 cm per level to the south, shade and protect the surfaces of the facade windows from direct sunlight while allowing more diffused light to enter the apartments from the north. The proportion of different sizes and layouts of dwellings within a building is always a particular dilemma for developers. Therefore, a flexible architectural and structural system was designed by T2 Data Architects that allowed for a quick and flexible change in the number of different sizes and types of apartments S-M-L-XL. To dynamically follow the changing client needs, an own algorithmic application was in-house developed by the architects, which allowed the change of the modular apartment units quickly and freely during the design process. The most distinctive element of the building's facade is the white-colored horizontal cornice, the wing profile, which runs around each level. This custom-designed and manufactured aluminum structure curving around the corners is a trademark, a strong design and functional element that emphasizes the dynamism of the building and provides rain protection and shading. 
The apartments are arranged in a clustered system around the vertical cores with a total of nine residential levels, including the ground floor, with typically four or five apartments per level and staircase. The large dwellings are connecting the two opposite facades, while the smaller dwellings face the south elevation. The V-shaped A building part next to the Danube and the L-shaped B building part facing the bay have a total of around 350 apartments, including car storage on the two basement levels. The basement garage levels are elevated a half level above the ground so that the watertight reinforced concrete structure of the garage also acts as a flood protection structure.